I really just love the idea of finding new knowledge and being able to share it with other people. My name is Rihanna Simon. I'm a sophomore here at UAB. I looked at a lot of other schools and a lot of them, you know, they would say, oh, if you're a junior or a senior, you start doing research, right? But here at UAB, you're able to begin as a freshman if you have the drive and the motivation to do so. So that's just an amazing opportunity that a lot of my other peers from high school weren't able to get in their college. I actually started working under Dr. Day when he was a postdoc. Uh, and so what Dr. Day was doing with his research, I just found it really fascinating and I really fell in love with the research. I really ask a lot of these students. I, I like them to be in the lab for at least 10 to 20 hours a week. I think that really gives them a chance to develop their own interest within our overall research theme. Um, and so the, the outcome of that is that they are able to kind of develop their own independent line of thinking, their own independent projects, and hopefully uh, down the road we'll have a much better shot at having a, a, a publication result from that. My lab studies the epigenetic regulation of neuronal function, and that includes the, our ability to form new memories, uh, the processes that go on when people become addicted to drugs of abuse, uh, and just basic mechanisms that regulate how neurons respond to things in the environment. What I find really cool about this research is that it's basic research, right? It isn't applied trying, you know, trying to find specific treatments or cures for different disorders. But what's so fascinating about it, because it's basic, in a way it's paving a road for us to potentially find those cures and treatments. It's a good chance for them to come into a lab, uh, really get settled and uh, develop uh, uh, their own interests that will you know, kind of establish their own career arc.